Hey, welcome back to Stalker Clear Sky. Uh, we are in, I think, Dark Valley. We just got to Dark Valley. It's not telling me the name of the area, but I'm pretty sure this is Dark Valley. Uh, I came from the Cordon. Uh, because Sidorovich told us, uh, gave us some information about Fang. He was the, the one asking questions. Uh, and then we, he said to look in the garbage, I think, and then we found more information leading us to Dark Valley, so we came here. Um, uh, and at the end of the last episode, this guy over here was talking to me, so I think I have to go see what he wants real quick. Okay. And still, brother, this won't hurt. Uh. All right. All right, stalker, stay put. Who are you, and what are you doing here? Do you really need to aim down your sights <laughs> for this one? Uh, I'm a mercenary. I'm looking for a stalker called Fang. He's probably dead already, and I suggest you don't hang around here too long, unless you want to join him. Why dead? What's going on here? Someone keeps attacking us. They're real professional about it, too. Mm, never interesting. Chance. We control all the roads leading into the Dark Valley, but that don't seem to stop the attacks one bit. The one place you can relax is the base. If you have questions about Fang, the Freedom Base is your best bet. Oh, these guys are Freedom. I see that now. Okay, so Freedom is a lot further south in this game. I guess they migrated north between now and the first game. Thanks for the information. So we're chill? Oh, it sounds like there's gunfire over there. What was that shooting all about? What's going on over there? Yeah, I want to know that too. Damn, another attack. Mark, check for survivors at the outpost. Uh, you got it. I'm going. Let's go ahead and quick save. Just in case, uh, help repel the attack. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, radiation. I don't think it was. No, that's not too bad. I think I'm fine. Oh, they're all dead. That's not good. Get up on the box! Ha ha! You stupid animal! Ow! How did he hit me? I am bleeding a bit. Alright. Oh, is this gun in bad condition? Where is it? No, it's fine. I mean, it's like 90%. That should be fine. None of these guys had anything. Is this... Oh, my shotgun is in shit condition. I do remember there was a way in through a pipe over here. Oh, there's just a, a gate this time. Okay. Can I still even walk into the pipe? Looks like I can. I don't want to step in the water, though. 
Hey. You good? What's up with you? We're sitting around. Okay. New base. New freedom base. It looks like uh, they've got all the important NPCs, like uh, Mechanic, which important character, another guide. Oh, that's the symbol for Trader. Okay. Looks like a shower head or something. I don't know what that is. Uh, and then Commandant. We gotta ask the Commandant about Fang. Oh, that scared me. Yo, hey, shot. We get a walk frame over here or what? That will be twenty dollars. It's sheepskin. All right, get them from the commandant. Come again? So how about it, hey. shot? Hey, hey, guys, you. Okay? You're on the PA. You're a real jerk. You know that? You got to take your finger off the button. Nothing all day. Hey, you go suck my cut. That bullshit, you. Oh, okay. I guess he did. Traitor? Hey, buddy! What will you be needing today? Wham bam, thank you, mercenary! Wham bam, thank you, mercenary. Alright, let's sell... This? Probably sell some of these pistols. I don't want to ever sell this thing. I might fix it up, though. I kind of want to sell the shotgun, to be honest. It just, like, holy crap, it feels so bad to use. It never hits anything. And when it hits, it doesn't kill anything. I am. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do it. Sell all the bullets for it. Give me a bit of extra cash. Lighten my inventory. I think the AK is probably plenty. Um, I think I wanted to keep one of these bigger guns. Which one is actually better? I think it'll compare if I equip one. Okay, this one looks like... It's kind of hard to see the green. I think it has a little bit extra rate of fire. And a little bit more condition, but... I mean, the condition doesn't really matter. Plus, I like the look of this better. 9 by 19 Okay, they both use the same ammo. But... I'm selling this. I know I spent a ton on upgrades for it, but... It's just, like... Not accurate enough. I think this one I picked up is more accurate. So let's use that for now. I'm keeping Martha. Selling this. And it's just the same thing, except it doesn't come with upgrades. So I'm going to sell this, too. Uh, this uses 9x18. Okay, so... I wonder if I can upgrade it to use the better ammo. Or the bigger ammo. I guess I'll hold on to the ammo I have just for now. Um, that looks good. 415 rubles. Man, you, like, make nothing off trading. Should I buy anything? Six thousand, seven thousand. Seems like the suits are a lot cheaper. But I like my clear sky suit for now. Um, alright. That looks good. That looks good. Let's uh, visit the... Well, let's talk to this guy first. But then I want to visit the, the mechanic. Me again? Man, what a lousy day. Sup, Lingov? 
You chose a bad area for a walk, buddy. Don't you know we're being attacked day and night? Hanging out in our base is dangerous enough, but wearing a freedom jacket will make you a target. I'm looking for a star called Fang. Ever heard of him? I don't know him personally. Some hobo came by a few days ago. He and our chief had some shady business to discuss. No witnesses, of course. It could have been your guy, but I don't really know. How can I see the leader of freedom? Ah, you sure got a short temper, buddy. Listen up. Forget about seeing the chief while we're in quarantine. I mean, you're just a merc. That said, if you do me a favor of sorts, I'll put in a good word with the big man. So what do you say? Uh, okay, what's the job? A pseudo-dog has settled down near the base and is making life hell for us. As soon as it smells food being cooked at the bar, you can kiss your ass goodbye. The boys are all jumpy and nervous because of that damn thing. You take care of this problem for us, and when you come back, we'll get down to real business. Alright, consider it done. Monster hunting instead of Just killing a single dog? Doesn't really seem like a big deal. I wonder where it is. Oh, I guess that's it. Mutant. Okay. Sounds pretty easy. Alright, mechanic. How do do, Mr. How do do? Hello, Merc. Feel like making some cash? Yeah? I really need some cash? I have a job that needs doing. But, but the doing best be real quiet. No witnesses, you feel me? Come see me when it gets dark at around 11. Oh, okay. Share your experience with me. What's the best way to improve weapons and armor? Experience is something I've got a plenty. I'll tell you this. Don't try and improve everything at once. You don't have the most powerful shooter that's also the most accurate. You're dreaming. Say you increase your weapon stopping power once. Then next time, do the same. That's because there are upgrades you can't remove. If you decide to make a sniper rifle out of a weapon you made powerful, it's gonna be too late. So you need to think ahead and think well. Oh, that seems like good advice. So I need to, like, specialize my weapons and, um... Like, make, make one really accurate, but if I have that, then... I need one that, like, does a lot of damage for... A different situation maybe stuff like that um, any useful info for a stalker useful useful in our line of work means something that's gonna help you stay alive yeah that or something that's gonna make your enemy dead yeah I'll tell you about artifacts oh okay I'm actually curious about how artifacts are gonna work in this game I don't I don't think I've found any yet at least that I remember Artifacts were really kind of disappointing in the first game, though. Uh, they just they didn't really seem to have any major impact in gameplay whatsoever. And they weren't all that valuable. Uh, what's an artifact? It's a cluster of anomalous energy, kind of like a stock cube. There's also artifacts that can... Uh, what's the damn word? Uh, right. Generate anomalies. I think that's how Chekhov says it. Anyway, only problem is, once the artifact generates an anomaly, it's as good as useless. The anomaly itself ain't exactly powerful, nor does it last long, but it's good enough to delay someone, or knock them off your trail altogether. Oh, okay, so maybe it's, maybe he's talking like, like some uh, artifacts work like special grenades, I guess? Like smoke grenades, or, or maybe flashbangs or something? That's kind of what it sounds like, the way he describes it, but I guess we'll find out. Uh, let's just jump to the upgrades. Out of their asses. Nah, it's not me. Definitely want to fix the rifle. Cost a thousand to fix it? Okay, never mind. I do need more money. What about this? 158. Well, if I'm not going to use it immediately, I don't know. Accuracy. I think accuracy is king. I'm still under that impression.
This replacement can only be performed once. 9 by 18 Isn't that... Isn't that the weaker caliber? 9 by 19 Yeah, why... Why would I want to bring it down a caliber? Just for, like, convenience? Because they're easier to get, maybe? Full metal jacket round provides good stopping power against soft targets. With enhanced stopping power, ineffective against armored targets. Okay. 9 by 19 Full metal jacket. It doesn't say anything, really. I guess it's just convenience. So I'm never going to take that. Um, okay. I really would like to um, repair this AK. But I don't have anywhere near enough cash. What is this? Armor condition. I guess I'm going to save my cash for now. Alright, let's um, quick save again. And go kill this dog. Can't imagine it would be too difficult. Oh, it's right there. I'm never gonna look at the look at that crosshair. As far as I can tell, it doesn't really seem like aiming down the sights makes it improve any amount beyond what the crosshair already shows. I can kind of try to test it, but I don't really want to waste too much ammo. All right, so we're doing the full crouch, and it's like, all right. I've kind of like memorize the uh it's like halfway through the second square on each of them or i guess like three quarters yeah that that second shot went like way up where the crosshair was i don't know it doesn't seem like it makes it any more accurate to aim down sights i think it's just for me the player to aim better or something I don't I'm not sure anyway we're gonna have to get closer why would I bother I mean like why why would I walk through the poisonous swamp water when I could just walk around maybe I should grenade it where is it Oh! Oh! I didn't know I could do that. I... Is this cooking the grenade? No? Oh, something's going on. I'm running. <laughs> Help! 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 There's a lot more than just one dog. Why does it look like the bullets are exploding and why is my vision freaking out? Okay. It's like a hallucination or something. <laughs> Retreat! Retreat! They're illusions. What is going on? They just keep spawning back there. Oh, they're not quite illusions. That actually hurt. Or, no, it didn't. What the heck is happening? Wait, can I not take damage while I'm in Freedom Base? Too early to rest. We gotta wait. 
Is that what's going on? Is that all of them? No. That must be the real dog up there. Oh, this is so weird. This is so weird. I'm just gonna shoot it. Gotta stop being a coward. I mean, this would be a really good spot for a grenade, so... Okay, so that this one dog was spawning all the like specter dogs. Crazy. Stash? It's gonna be empty. Yep. Always is. Without fail. Alright, let's just get back. I did search the dog, right? I don't think they ever have anything. They're just animals. It'd be cool if you could get, like, like super meat from them that heals a bunch or something. <laughs> but I feel like you'd be more likely just to get radiation poisoning and die. So At ease, gentlemen? What did you want to tell me? Nothing? Back off. I hate that intercom. <gasps> forgot. I forgot about the pit. It's me, Merc. That's my name, Merc. Everybody knows Merc. So did that dog give you the runaround? It doesn't matter. The bottom line is the beast is dead. Alright. Your next task is a little tougher. Listen up, we've got to deliver this ammo to our guys at the far outpost. Shoot straight for Ashots. He'll tell you what exactly you have to log in to wear. Roger that. Bothering me over nothing. I'm busy. I me again? killed Man, your dog for you. Day. Ass? Wait. Collect your reward. Oh. Okay. Hey, Mr. Fixie, we got a used gun. You have a look? That will be twenty dollars. Hey, come on. Yesterday joke. Guys really need to stop using the PA system to have conversations with each other. What's up, dude? Got something for me? Five hundred. I'll take it. I'm desperate. Intercepted some radio comms about some lab when he was at Yantar. Said comms were so strange and scary, he turned his receiver off real quick. Another fella told me he encountered a semi-transparent creature in a protective suit. Huh. That's weird. Way more advanced than anything stalkers wear. That transparent thing told him, Leave, we are working, you are interrupting our work. Then again, supposedly this happened right next to the radar. Don't be quick to believe all that stuff, bro. But then, who knows? Maybe the zone really did turn those people into pure energy. Interesting. I don't know what that's about. But, I'm sure I missed a ton of different lore stuff from the first game, so... Maybe I should know what that's about. Uh... If you wanna lift the elbow, swing by. How I'm much can I sell you. this stuff for? I wanna sell all of this. Hell yeah! Oh, absolutely I wanna sell all of that. Let's go down to like six vodkas. I didn't. This stuff is crazy. It's worth so much. Even a sausage sausage is fifty. Two thousand. Just selling food is better than selling guns and ammo. <laughs> I guess food would be hard to come by in this place, so maybe it makes sense. Everybody needs to eat. 
And food doesn't last as long as guns. Hey, buddy. I shot. What have you been eating today? The commandant sent me. I'm here for the ammo. Oh, so we found a hero after all. Why a hero? That's because no one's got the guts to even take a peek outside. In two days, we've had three attacks on our outposts. And 15 men dead. Wow. No one has any idea who it was. But whoever it was, they're always a step ahead of us. They always know where our squad will be next and execute their plan to the T. Can't help feeling it's one of our own leaking information to them. Oh well. Here's a package for, for you from our boys. I've uploaded the coordinates to your PDA. Break a leg. Okay, so I guess I'm not allowed to use this stuff, probably. Oh. Yeah. I think I'd probably get in trouble if I used it. I don't think I can use it anyway, though. You know what? We got, got money this, now. Come I want to upgrade. Not anything. upgrade. I want to repair this gun. I know that costs a lot. And it sucks, but... Uh, but I, I think it'll be worth it in the long run. I'd also like... I'd kind of like to fix up this gun. To be honest. I'm going to do it. I'm gonna do it. Get the accuracy. Those are the most important to me. What is this? Magazine size, I don't really care too much about. Rate of fire is not super important. I don't think recoil is that important either. If I buy the recoil, I can buy this. Oh no, if I buy the weight, I can buy this. But I'd need to buy this as well. Yeah, it looks like it. And then I need these two for this one, which is flatness. Which I think is probably good. Um, I'm just going to stick with the, uh, the upgrades I have for now. Uh, and let's, let's take a look. So this is better condition. It's still slightly less accuracy than this one. Nine by eighteen. For a... Okay. What did you... Well, if it's less accuracy. Goodbye, laddie. <laughs> if it's less accuracy, I don't think I want to deal with it. Let's just do this. Can I sell things to him? No. All right, I'm I'm holding on to it, but I think I think the Martha is is destined to uh, be sold at this point. All I care about is accuracy. I want my bullets to land where I'm shooting. Oh, I like the look of the Martha, though. And actually, it looks more accurate. Hang on. How can I measure this? I need something to measure it with. Alright, so that's like touching all the points of that brown triangle thing. Yeah. So now let's switch to this gun. Aim it. It is. The accuracy lies. I'm really glad I didn't sell it then. This says it's less accurate, but it's not. I'm so confused. Alright, hang on. Maybe I'm just reading these wrong. Maybe the, the green and the red is... So the blue bar... Okay, I think I am just reading it wrong. I'm an idiot. The blue is... Like, where the blue stops is what the gun I'm currently looking at. That's its stats. And then the green and red... Are... That doesn't make any sense. If the green and red are both the the gun I'm comparing it to, why would the condition not be green as well? Or why would the accuracy not be red as well? 
die. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm going to trust the crosshair. I think the Martha is going to be better. That's that's weird. Maybe I'll figure it out later. All right, let's get a move on. Wait, am I going the right way? No, I'm supposed to be delivering ammo here. All right, let's just cut across. Nobody wanted to walk like like a hundred yards out of the base to give somebody some ammo. Oh. Okay, well they died. And I need to recover a PDA. That's creepy. What is killing these guys? It must be that, like, invisible thing the barkeep was talking about, maybe. Or, like, a bunch of them. Find the active PDA. <gasps> I just spent a thousand dollars fixing up this <laughs> AK. <laughs> Dang it. Shoot. Hang on. Let's compare. Seems like they're the exact same. This one has less handling and less rate of fire. Is 5.56 five, more powerful? I don't know. I guess it is. Just take all this stuff. Yeah, loot it all for now. Just loot it all. I'm going straight back to the base. I don't mind the wait. Oh, there's the PDA. message log for that I who was that they were mad at freedom so it wasn't it's, it wasn't for me to hear I think oh I got too much equipment I can't walk it's gonna be a long road back I'm just like trudging, <laughs> trudging along the wall with like six assault rifles hanging off my shoulders. Merc, what are you doing with all that? I've got some rifles to sell. <gasps> did, did those come off of our guys? No, no. No, I've had these. I've, these are mine. Uh, but I thought you guys might want to use them. I can't get through here, can I? Oh, this is going to suck. I went the wrong way. I got to go all the way around here, I think. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. I shot. I shot, please. Take these guns. 
I can make it to him. I can make it. Wait a second, fella. I'll be right there. Hey, buddy. Looking for a good deal, eh? Have I got a deal for you? You crap on me. I'll know better next time. Um. Whoops. No, that one's fine. I want to keep the best condition, which is that one. I don't want any of these guns, so I don't have to worry about which one to keep. Uh, I'm selling the Fora. Making the executive decision. I'd like more med kits, I guess. How expensive are these? 400. I'll probably find more, right? How much is that? 300? Alright, that's worth it. Trade. Okay, I'm back up to 2600. I'm feeling light. Oh, he's in trouble. I think he's, he got in trouble. Wait, he was the... I don't know. I think common, I the Commandant Speak might have been the rat, maybe? So, what did but you I missed most of that message, that radio message I overheard, so I, I can't be sure. But I, I think it was somebody that didn't like Freedom, and they mentioned the Commandant, I think? I'll have to listen back to it while I'm editing. <laughs> Or maybe this guy will just tell me. Welcome to my humble abode. Chekhov. Well, well, finally we meet face to face. My name is Chekhov, and I'm the boss around here. The recording on the PDA you found clears things up a bit. All the exits from the valley were sealed off, but our outposts and patrols just kept getting hit. A few times we had the patrol leave the base and get slaughtered in no time. The boys started thinking that we offended the zone somehow, and that this was some sort of punishment. We even tried putting together protection charms against ghosts and all, but as we now know, there was nothing mystical about yeah, it. Yeah, the commandant the was commandant the rat. gave away all our movements. What an ass. Freaking rat. An unpleasant turn of events. I didn't expect him to do this. I've known him for ages. We hunted for our first artifacts together. We made freedom what it is today. I trusted him with all the operational planning, and he just went and sold us out. And where is the Commandant now? As soon as the outpost conversation was aired on our radio frequency, the Commandant vanished. He knew he was screwed. What we've got to do now is find him. He knows too much, if not everything. All the exits from the valley are secured, so he couldn't have gone too far. We're tracking his PDA. He's near the road to the cordon. A few of our squads are on their way over there. I heard a stalker by the name of Bang was here. Yep, there was a stalker like that. Very interested in rare parts and the like. He must have known that we had the best team in the whole zone. I sold him the part he wanted, and why not? He paid well and didn't even haggle. What I don't know is what he wanted with it. These parts were only used in old army cryptographic machines. He left the base cryptographic away, machines. And nobody's seen him since. So that must be Fang trying to build the decoder for the door, I would guess. I think Fang was the one that built it. The secret door that I got into in, at the end of the last game. Do you know where Fang could yeah, have gone? I'll help you. If you help me, that is. Don't take it personally, but we're having a rough time. And if things don't change, Freedom won't have enough men to defend the base from bandit attacks. Help me find out who is attacking us, and I'll give you information about Fang. All right. Sure thing. What do I do? Find the Commandant and bring him to me, alive. Or dead. Do that, and I'll tell you where you can find Fang. I've uploaded the coordinates of the Commandant's PDA to yours. Agreed. 
What does your clan do? Our clan lives in the zone and studies it in a practical sense. I believe that the zone is an unbelievable scientific opportunity for the whole of humanity. For several years now, the zone has produced artifacts which are fantastic research materials, and there are more and more of them every day. As for anomalies, you couldn't recreate the experimental conditions they generate in any lab. I have no doubt that in a few years' time we will see a massive leap in science and other areas of human knowledge thanks to our research here in the zone. This leap will be felt by everyone, even those, even people whose closest contact with science and technology is their cell phone. It's, it seems like freedom is basically the same thing as clear sky, except freedom is, is more powerful and clear sky is just trying to keep secret living in a swamp. <laughs> So far, I, I can't see any difference between the two factions from what I've heard. Um, why do you dislike duty so much? Dislike, that's a very soft way of putting it. We have nothing in common. In my opinion, their struggle against the zone only leads to the zone resisting harder. Uh, put simply, duty is a faction of... Of your standard dim-witted jarheads who wear, n oh, who hear nothing, see nothing, and only know how to pull a trigger. We've been fighting pretty much since the moment we got here, and sooner or later, only one faction will remain. Um, I don't think I want to join them yet. Right. Enough talking. Let's get to work. I might join them eventually, but I need more information, I guess. That's funny. Come in, come in, stalker. I wonder if this is uh, like a callback, cause um, I think uh, somewhere around here. It wasn't in this building, but um, the guy, the the bandit leader, that lives in this outpost, in the first game is called Boar, and he's got a boar trophy on his wall. I don't know if that's a reference or, or what, but it's cool. Alright, um, I guess that's where we're going to go ahead and end here. Ah, uh, things are looking pretty good. I've got some new equipment that I'm feeling pretty good about. I'm learning more about the game. Uh, and we're getting closer to finding Fang. We just need to go get this commandant, wherever he is. Oh, he's just right there. Alright, uh, that'll be next time. I'll see ya.